This afternoon, we are shining the light on a former Tampa Bay Buccaneer who continues to be a positive force in this community. Long after his departure from the Bucks and the NFL, we are talking about Ryan Neese. Last night, his foundation provided a Thanksgiving feast to more than 1,000 people in East Hillsborough County with more than 175 volunteers to help make it all happen. The event is just one of several programs that he does to show the power of giving. The power of giving is a mantra of the foundation, and it's something that is built into all of our different programs. Our clinic, where we help and inspire athletes to become better from the inside out. It's our scholarship program where we provide scholarships, but at the same time now are providing a service project to take kids to the Dominican Republic to allow them to have perspective and impact the lives of others. It's from our holiday programs where we're able to feed 1,500 individuals during Thanksgiving or a holiday program during Christmas time where we're working with 150 kids and really loving on them and, and, and giving them the support that they need. When you give something to somebody, you feel like you're, you're making an impact on that person. But in reality, the power of giving is all about you're actually receiving way more back than you're giving to that person. And we are delighted to have Ryan in the studio with us. Thank you for doing that. It's always so nice to see all the many things that you do in the community. Uh, it's, um, it's a passion. And uh, it's, a, it's an opportunity for us as a, for, as a foundation, as an organization, mm -hmm. to really um, embrace those individuals that are in need, but at the same time, really empower um, everybody in our community to um, believe in something we believe in, the power of giving. Mm -hmm. This Thanksgiving feast was by no means the first. <laughs> You've been doing it since 2007? Yes. We've been doing it for a number of years. And, every year it continues to grow. I mean, we had 175 volunteers and we had organizations like Humana and uh, Metropolitan Ministries and a number of other orga organizations support our efforts uh, to try to make an impact. And when you have an opportunity to feed, uh, you know, over a thousand people in about a three hour period of time, <laughs> it's a pretty chaotic day, but at the same time, it's just so moving and so powerful to see a light in somebody's eyes, to see a smile on somebody's face and to be able to allow them to leave the reality and come and enjoy a, a night of entertainment, a night of good food and some great desserts, of course. <laughs> um, it's just a special time for us. One of the things that the community leaders talk about most with your foundation is what you're doing with young people. Um, last night there were members of the leadership program there yeah. and how does this kind of help them develop as the leaders of tomorrow? Yeah, you know what? One of the things that we strive and kind of the bread and butter of our program is our student service program where we try to teach and inspire teenagers to embrace the philosophies of power of giving, right? And we try to instill those things in, in those young minds to be able to encourage them to be selfless, to be able to encourage them to be courageous mm -hmm. in helping others. And so that we're planting a seed so that when they're the next Lissettes and they're the next CEOs and they're the next VPs in our community, that they're striving to make a positive impact in our community. And if we can plant that seed early and we can support that and nurture that, mm -hmm. that's what we want to do as an organization. How many kids are part of the program this year? Each year we have a, a number of different uh, kids, but this year, particular year, we have 15 kids, and that number will continue to grow. So anybody out there that wants their okay. students to be involved with our organization, uh, they can go to the website, Ryan East Foundation, and, and uh, get all... It's a year-long program. It's a year-long program. It's actually a two-year program. Uh, they come in as juniors. They go through the program. Uh, they spend uh, a, a number of hours with us throughout their junior year, their senior year. They become mentors to the, to the incoming Great. juniors. Well, thank you for everything you do. Congratulations. And if you would like to connect with the Ryan Neese Foundation and also help fund this wonderful program that they do with the students, please join him on December the 3rd at the Pepin Hospitality Center for Ryan's Rockin' Holiday Party. For details and ticket information, you can visit online at ryanneesefoundation.com.